Syria are flocking to movie theaters for the premiere of the story of a Navy SEAL operation in Afghanistan that ended in tragedy. And the movie Lone Survivor is hitting close to home. But one of the Navy SEALs was married to a woman from Yuba City that he met in Chico. And his death has forever changed her family's life. News 10's Dave Marcos joins us tonight with a story. Dave? Well, now, Christina, Matt Axelson was one of the SEALs on that mission to take out a notorious Taliban leader who allegedly had close ties to Osama bin Laden. He just said that he'd be out for a few days and wouldn't be calling her. That night in June 2005 was the last time Cindy Axelson would ever speak to her husband, Matt. A man Cindy's father, Artie Oji, in Yuba City says you would never imagine would be a Navy SEAL. He was very, very quiet. He, he didn't like to draw attention to himself. And uh, he was almost shy. In the film, Axelson, a SEAL Team sniper, is portrayed very well, according to OG, who says director Peter Berg was on a personal mission to honor the men who were lost. It was not just another movie to make money with. It was a personal crusade on his part to, to get this thing done. At his wedding to Cindy, Axelson also danced with his cousin, Amanda Spielman. As a 10-year-old, I didn't know anything. It was... My cousin was missing. My cousin was gone. She, too, is grateful the movie was made. I think it does bring a face to all of them for anyone who's thousands of miles away fighting their, these people with these families. For OG, the film is important for the same reason, and also because it may make Americans ask why the decade-long... ...really great men and women killed and hurt. You know, I, I just don't know why we're there. Myself... Now, she says that the film was difficult to watch when he saw a director's cut last year and then at the premiere in New York City, but he says it's as accurate as you're going to get. Tonight, he and his wife went to see it again with a neighbor, and he says, Dylan Christine, it's a film that Americans should go and see. Yeah, a lot of people have read the book, but, you know, I'm anxious to see the film as well. Yeah. I'm so glad that these family members see this as a tribute and that it was well done. Yeah, yeah. The soldiers, obviously. It's it's important. so appreciated it, yeah. Thanks, Dave. Yeah. Thank you. We want you to take a look at this. Video shows Coast Guard crew members plucking dramatic rescue that happened near San Luis San Francisco Bay to Morro Bay when his third foot sailboat ran aground. He managed to call for help. The sailor was cold, wet foot. It looks like New York City Mayor Bill de Blasio's pizza came with a side of controversy. The new mayor was seen at a Staten Island pizza joint digging into his slice with a knife and fork. That is a huge no-no for many New Yorkers who believe pizza should be folded and eaten with the hands. De Blasio prides himself on his Italian-American heritage.